Alrighty, hello guys, Welcome Me Faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are playing Stormworks once again, and today we are actually going to be building a experimental plane. Now, the experimental plane that we are going to be basing this off is the Northrop XP-56 Black Bullet. Now, if you guys don't know what that is, it's a little bit like the, uh, the Goblin. Uh, the plane that was actually dropped from other planes as a Parasite Fighter. But this one took off from the ground. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and try and build it. Let's get on with it, shall we? Okie dokie, so I actually want a really like, I, I want this to work, I don't know how well this is going to work, but let's go ahead and try it. So we're going to go ahead and do this to begin with, uh, we're going to have two of those, that is excellent. We're then going to go into one of those, and then we're actually going to go straight into one of these, there we go, excellent. We're going to do pretty much exactly the same thing on the other side, so let's go ahead and grab all of this, copy it, turn it around, flip it over, put it on the bottom, there we go, epic. Merge this with this, that is actually excellent, that's really good. We're then going to go backwards in, um, I guess, like, pretty much a straight line for a little bit. And then we're going to bend it round and attach it back on at the butt. However, we're going to do it slightly differently on the back end because we should. So, there you go. So, we're going to do it somewhat like this. There we go. Excellent. We'll then change it into this and we'll have two of these. Uh, if at all possible. There we go. Two of those. And then I think we might be able to end up with, I don't know, one of these. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, so, wait, actually, this isn't gonna work, so we're gonna have to leave it somewhat like this. Uh, but we'll leave it just like that instead, because that makes sense. And then we'll do pretty much exactly the same thing, um, but coming back the other way. There we go. Alright, go ahead and copy it, flip it over, turn it around, move it upwards. And paste it right there. Excelente! Delete these guys, delete these guys, and we're gonna have a flat wall right there. Merge this with this. Excellent. And that's actually pretty good. Nice. Honestly, it's not really that long, but uh, we're going to make it a little bit longer because otherwise this isn't going to really work out for us. So go ahead and cut this. We'll move it backwards a good chunk uh, to about, let's say, there. Excellent. We'll then merge these guys back together like so. So merge this one with this one. And that's excellent. I think that'll be fine. Okie dokie. So with that being said, we need to get ourselves a propeller. One of them is going to be a rotor end thingamabobby like this. And then the other one is actually going to be an end that goes on there, but obviously the other way, because uh, it has contra-rotating props on the uh, backside, which is pretty cool. We're going to make them, like, really small, which might be weird, but there you go. Uh, and they both need to be neutral. There we go. Cool. Okie dokie. So now that that's been done, let's go ahead and try and build ourselves a bit of a... Um, uh, I, I guess the whole um, fuselage. That's, that's what I'm trying to say. We have to build an entire fuselage for this thing. Uh, it's very, very round, so I'm not entirely sure how well this is going to go. But we're going to go ahead and try and make it pretty round uh, all the way along. But we'll see. Uh, so we'll do that. Excellent. Uh, we'll go ahead and grab one of... Wait, where is it? Where is it? These guys. We're going to go ahead and put this all the way down the side, like so. And yeah, it's going to be like really, really round. Is that a bad idea? I'm not sure. Okay, but uh, I think that's actually fine for now. Um, realistically, I would like it to continue being round all the way around, but uh, I don't know. So we're going to do this up to there. Actually, in fact, what we are going to do is this. This is going to make things a little bit more difficult for us, but we're going to go ahead and put it in anyway. Because uh, that is where we're going to have to make it become a um, a cockpit, if that makes sense. So it's a little bit off. Obviously, but I think this will be fine. Maybe. Yeah, so actually, I'm completely fine with this. Let's go ahead and grab this from the front, all the way down to here, all the way down to the other side, and all the way down the edges. This side and also this side. Copy it, flip it over, turn it around, put it on the bottom, and wow! There we go. Excellent! That's pretty good. Uh, right. With that being said, we now need to attach these guys. So put that in there. Put this little piece on here. Excellent. And then do these two, and we should be good to go. Alright, this one. Right in there like so, and right in there like so. That's pretty epic. That does actually work. Nice! So far, this is actually looking pretty good. Okie dokie, so with all that being said, we now need to extend pretty much all of it backwards as we go. There we go, just like that, just like that. Uh, again, just like this, and again, just like this. That is pretty good. We're then going to do all of this. Yes. Realistically, we should start working on the back end now as well. 
Uh, and I'm sorry about the camera randomly flicking like that. I'm not sure why it's doing it, but uh, it is. And it's constantly doing it, which is super annoying. So I'm sorry about that. But uh, that's okay. There we go. Excellent. Go ahead and put this piece on here like... Ah, like so. There we go. Good. And that should be a-okay, actually. Go ahead and put this piece on here and on here. And then fix it all together and we should be good to go. All right, there we go. Excellent. Delete those. And put this piece on, just like this. And that should actually be... Yeah, this works. Okay, so that's all a-okay. Let's go ahead and send this bit backwards like so. We'll then actually grab one of these guys. Ah, I hate this camera. What is it doing this for? What is it doing this for? It's really weird. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and connect this with this. There we go. That actually does fit. It totally works. And that is a-okay, actually. It, it's, it fits. It fits with what we want. Uh, go ahead and put that piece on there. Go ahead and do this little bit as well. There we go. Excellent. And it's actually fitting in quite nicely with what we what we wanted. We're going to do one more of these. Okay, so it goes up and over the top like so. Delete this little bit in the middle. Put this little tiny bit in. As we go, and that's actually fine. Yeah, that's mighty fine. This is really good. Uh, we're then obviously going to do the rest of it, so we need some other pieces. We need some of these to match up with it. So delete this one on the end. Continue with these guys. There we go. Delete this one. Put this in. Excellent. And then all we need to do is this, and voila, we have ourselves the right shape. This is cool. Okay, so from some of the pictures, uh, some of them actually have like a pretty big vertical stabilizer and then on other pictures, some of them have very small vertical stabilizers. So I'm not entirely sure how I want this stabilizer to look, but we're going to make it be one of the, uh, a big one. We're going to make it a big one because I think it'll be easier to actually control the entire vehicle if it is a big one. So there we go. We're going to do this. We're going to actually have it go you straight up using one of these guys uh, from about there. And actually from about there. And that is sick. There we go. Excellent. Go ahead and attach all this together. We can have ourselves a thingamabobby in here. One, two, three. One, two, three. We can have our rudder on there. And that should be fine. All right. Whack it on. Whack it on. Yeah, I guess that fits. I mean, maybe we should make it a tiny bit bigger. But just a tiny bit. So we'll actually do this and this. There we go. That's sick. Yeah. Bam. Whack all of that together. That's cool. I like it. Alright, so I'm not actually entirely sure how far back the wings start from, but it is pretty far back. Um, and yeah, it's about here. So what we'll do is... I don't really know how I want the wings to look. I'm not very good at getting the wings the right size. On pretty much anything I build, the wings are always somewhat wrong. Like, they, they don't work properly. But we're going to go out and do something like that. There we go, delete this one. We're actually going to go ahead and delete this piece... And also this piece, because we need a pivot. There we go. Pivot's going to go in here. So, uh, robotic pivot, go ahead and put it right there like this. All right, we're going to go ahead and grab this guy from this side. We're going to cut it. We're going to paste it. We're going to take it to the other side. There we go. We're going to go ahead and cut it, and we're going to paste it. Right. Oh, God. Who oh, no. knew? All right, okay. So now we need to go delete this. Actually, no, we don't. We need to merge this with this, and then this with this, and now we have our wings on pieces, on things. All right, this is good. So far, so good, guys. It's working. Okay, so I don't know. I've just been messing around a little bit with this. I think that if we build the wing like that, it looks a bit weird, but I feel like it should actually work out fine for us, maybe. And then we actually need another pivot on the end of this, because it has like little, it has like a little dip in it. So... This goes on here like that, right? And then we build a wing onto it, which is weird already. It's already pretty strange, but let's do this. There we go. Excellent. And oh, maybe not like that, actually. Hang on. I want it to go like this. All right, so I want one of these to go on here. And I want it to do the right thing. There we go, like that. Excellent. We're then going to continue this outwards a little bit. There we go, and we'll also put this guy right on there. Okay, fine. That's uh, actually pretty good. Bam, bam. Excellent. Fill this in. Boop. And what is happening to my camera? It's so annoying. Right, okay, so that's all good. We can then add, I guess, one of these to here like this. And that bit will sort of angle down and be okay, I think. 
Maybe. You know, I'm kind of feeling like maybe this angle isn't too good. Maybe we should just make it look like this. I think that likes to be fine. Yeah, I think this is good. Okie dokie, so now we actually need two numbers. Let's go ahead and put one right there and one right there. One is going to be minus... Sorry, 0.2 and one is going to be minus 0.2... 0 0.2, I, I guess? I don't know. Is this the right way of doing things? I'm not entirely sure. But anyway, attach this onto here and here. And attach this onto here and here. There we go, and see what it does. So currently it won't do anything, but we're going to do this. Oh, I think the pivots are actually the wrong way around anyway, so they should both just do the same thing. There we go, because they're different to each other. Yeah, that's pretty sick, except we don't want it to be that much. So not point 0.1, I guess? Is that okay? Yeah, that's sick. That's what we need. Good. Okie dokie. So with that being said, now what I want to do is I want like a bit of an air inlet in here. So air, uh, we're actually going to use these for once, which is not something I generally go for, but let's do it. So let's go ahead and whack this on here like so. Uh, we'll make it a different color. In fact, we'll make it this color. And we'll sort of like... I don't know. <laughs> we'll sort of like siphon it into the side, if that makes sense. So grab one of these, turn it around, put it there. The other way around though. There we go. And do that sort of thing. Yeah. And we're going to have it somewhat go like into the side. So do this. And this. And there we go, we get ourselves some air inlets on the wings. I think that's fine. Like, I genuinely actually do think that that's okay. It looks a bit weird, to be fair, but it I, I think it's okay. Right, so we'll do this, we'll paint all of that in there, that's all good. Let's work on the canopy a little bit. See if we can make this work properly for us, and then see what we can do. Okie dokie, so don't worry about the space on the inside for right now. We're gonna build the canopy first. So windows, they're all gonna be built out of black glass stuff. So there we go, excellent. We're going to go ahead and whack in some more thingy -ma bobbies. So this has to go in the middle. Like, it genuinely just has to. So that's all right. We're going to do... I guess just a piece that goes over the top would be fine. So if we do genuinely just put this on here like this. And we do a lot of them. There we go. I don't actually mind the fact that it is, like, weird. In fact, actually, delete those two. We'll have one block in the middle that's strange. But then we'll have these guys be like this. There we go. I think that's sick. I think that actually looks real good. Uh, the window on the top is actually going to be... It's going to match. So it's going to just go like this. And then this. There we go. Match and match. And that actually looks pretty good for me. I like it. We're then going to do these guys. Show this and this. There we go. And we'll do the single one in the middle yet again. Okay, that's sick. No, it actually looks pretty good. I like it. Okie dokie, so now that we've done that, I think what I actually want to do is... I want to delete this piece real quick. I want to delete this bit real quick as well. And I want to send this, this way, like so. And I want to put one of these guys on there like this. Because I want it to fit in a little bit better, and I think that does it. Yeah, I think that's actually really good. Okay, so the other thing that I want to do as well, while we're still building, is... I want to replace the entire color with this green... Because it is a U.S. military plane. We're also then going to do this around the top of this. Because, again, U.S. military plane. I think that's okay. And I think that does actually look fine. I think that's okay. Um, all right, good. No, I'm happy with this so far. All right, wheels are going to be an issue, I feel. Uh, I think that I'm going to put them on the wing. Have them sort of curve up into this bit. And finish off behind here. Alright, this is going to be weird, but we're going to delete this again. There we go. And that's where my wheel is actually going to be stored. It's going to be stored right there, I believe. Yeah. Okay, right. How is this going to work, though? I have no idea. Uh, pivot. That is a wivet, not a pivot. Pivot! Let's do this. Come on. So, we need the green. We need a pivot. Let's do this. Uh, how big is this? So, this is currently... Four big. Alright, and we want the wheel to be like here, so it needs to be six. Alright, so six away from the center point. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. The pivot needs to go here. Here. Okay, so delete this and this. Pop the pivot in there. Bam! We'll do it like this, and then we'll actually have it just be 
Just a bar. F oh, God. Just a bar for now. We'll do one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. We need a wheel. And we need the wheel to go on here, I guess. And it needs to be quite a big one because that doesn't look too big. This doesn't look good enough. And actually, uh, put this here. Delete this one. Put the wheel on there. Bam! Make it bigger. Tire radius huge. Tire radius huge. And there we go. I think that's okay for the wheels. Uh, delete this one. It should fold up into there and maybe be okay. Maybe not. I don't know. Okay, we're doing it. So we need a throttle. Let's go. We need a throttle lever. It's just going to go on the side of the plane for now. Bam. We need it to work. So this goes on to the wing thingamabobby and also there. Let's put it in. Let's go. Come on. Oh, let's see if this works. I don't know whether it will. Please go the right way. It went the right way. It just hasn't really worked out too well for us. Sag. Okay, so what if that's not actually the tire's fault, but what if it's actually the fault of this right here? What if we delete that and we have it go into there? Does that actually now fit? Is the question. No, it doesn't. Sag. That's very sag. But you know what? That's okay. As long as it goes up a little bit, I'm actually completely fine with that. We're going to go ahead and seal this bit back off because there's no point in it being open, so... There you go. Alright, that's pretty sick. Now, the front landing gear is going to be a hell of a lot harder than that, I suppose. Um, Yeah, it is, actually. It's going to be a lot harder than that. Okay, so if you guys are here for the journey, let's do this. Uh, We need to grab, using this, we need to grab this piece. And a little bit further back as well. And also pretty much all of this. There we go. We need that to open up to let our landing gear out. So cut it. Paste it. Okay. Pretty weird. If you ask me. Uh, pivot. Let's go ahead and see what this actually does. I'm not sure what it will do. But let's see. Put that right there. Actually the other way around probably. Like this. And then throttle. Let's do this. So the throttle lever. On the side again. It's going to control this. See what it does. It isn't even attached. <laughs> It won't do anything if it's not attached, guys. Alright, merge. Ah! Merge. Merge this with this. Spawn it in, see what it does. Come on. So I want the door to open. To allow us entry in. But I can't even see what's going on there. I don't think that's right. I honestly don't think that that's right. So, yeah. We might need to actually put the pivot to the side. Yeah, robotic pivot. Go ahead and put it on there like that. Alright, merge it. See if this will even work. Because it might not even work, but I guess we'll see. I guess we will see. That is not doing anything. Because I haven't attached it. Alright, let's move the plane over towards us so we can see what's going on. Move it forwards as well. Paste it. Now right, here we go. Door opens. We'll be able to get our landing gear out of there. Sick. This is good. Okie dokie, so if we have landing gear inside of here somewhere, we need it to sort of be on a pole. So let's go like this. We'll grab this guy, actually, and we'll have it fold downwards. And that'll be okay. Hopefully this is fine. So one, two, three, four, three, maybe even five. There we go. Alright, cool. Delete this one. Put the wheel in there. Alright, let's see if this works. I hope it does. Three, there we go. Excellent. Tire radius, probably really big again. Delete this guy. Okay. Right, we're going to have another throttle lever. Just so we know what's going on here. We're going to attach this. Directly onto this. Spawn, uh, spawn it in. See what it does. Alright, ready? Open the door. Door is open. Pop out the wheel. Did it go upwards? It went upwards. We need the front one to be a minus. Minus for now. Minus one. Alright, there we go. So open the door. Excellent. Landing gear to come out. That's sick. It works. Guys, we did it. We've made landing gear that somewhat works. That is excellent. Alright, cool. So with that being said, what we need to do is make sure that this is the other way around. So grab one of these. Press U, paste it, merge it, and that should be good. Yes, we now have a landing gear that actually works. Excellent. Delete this one. Make sure it all works as one. Bam. Go. Did I merge it? I don't know if I merged it. 
There we go. Landing gear is out. That is sick. And then landing gear away. It, I think it will work. Yes, it will. Sick. That's really good. All right. Okay. Now that we've done that, we're going to go to the underside of this. We need to make sure that we have a little bit of a uh, vertical stabilizer here because that's how the real one went. We're going to put that right there. Put that right there. Do... Uh, just one of these, I guess, would be fine. And, yeah, just, just do something cool. There we go. Something like this could actually be... It could work. All right, go grab one of these. Put it on the underside. Like this. And honestly, I think that's fine. Yeah. All right, so now what we need is... Oh, there's lots of stuff that's going to be a problem with this. But honestly, we need a seat that is actually in here. So we need a seat. Let's go ahead and get a pilot seat, like this one. Delete that, put it there. That's way too low, so we'll actually have to put the pilot seat on a uh, slider that will allow the pilot seat to be a little bit higher. Yikesies. All right, okay. Uh, track. We need a track, like this one. Uh, yes, we do. But we need the track to start just behind this. So we need one of... These guys, right here, like this. And then we need the slider to go up the back. There we go. It probably only needs to go up one, so that's probably fine. Put this piece right here. Get ourselves a little seat. And whack it on there. I think we might need to move all of this backwards one. Alright, hang on. Hang on. There's a lot of stuff going on today, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Alright, cut this. Move it backwards one, paste it there, merge the right bits, there we go, get ourselves a new seat, put it in here, hopefully in the right place, where is it, there, there, is it too high, have I built it too high, alright hang on, hang on, delete this, delete this, delete this, delete that, I need to move it down, cut it, move it down one, paste it, good, alright excellent, we now need to merge that with this. Delete these ones. Merge this with this. Excellent. Put a piece right there. Good. Guys, we're doing it. We're doing things. I think I just accidentally put a block in as well. All right, so put that there. We need this to, like, automatically go up. So we need it on, like, this, which is just one. <laughs> I think this will work. I, I don't know. Spawn it in. Let's see what it does. Yes, the seat is in the right place. Landing gear, come out. Bam! This is excellent. All right, so just because I want to actually fly this thing today, let's go ahead and get some control surfaces on here real quick. Uh, we can actually just go ahead and delete this, like so. We need a rudder. Uh, we can actually just whack these guys right on there, I, I guess. In fact, actually, do it on both sides. So put this in there. Excellent. In fact, actually, do it like this on this side. Flip it over on the other side, like so. Excellent. We need a uh, pivot, like a uh, pitch. We need pitch controls. I currently don't have any. I'm going to try and hide them. Honestly, I'm actually going to try and hide the pitch controls. So they're going to be on control surfaces. Control surfaces, like these ones. And we're going to try and hide them at the back. So let's do one and two. There we go. Excellent. And one right there. Okay, so that's going to be our pitch. We got our roll. We got our yaw. We're good to go. We need a gyro, though, so go ahead and whack a gyro directly into here. That's excellent. Good. Uh, go ahead and connect this gyro up to one. That's fine. I'm going to connect the rest of this up together as well, and then once I've done that, I'll be back with you guys. All right, they're all connected. Now we just need a motor, and then we should be good to actually go. We're just going to put a massive motor on this. Uh, delete this guy right here. We need a pipe real quick. Go ahead and just do this and this and this. All right, put the motor on there. This is going to be, like, really back heavy if I do it this way, but we'll, we'll try it for now. Uh, go ahead and fill this in if we can. Bam. And that's excellent. And then we need another number, like this one. We need another one of these, because we need it to be minus one. Minus one. Uh, and that's going to go straight to the collective. Oh, my. Oh, my. It's going to go straight to the collective and the collective. Okay, excellent. This, this should work, guys. We're going to put up and down on here, and we're going to put it on there. Alright, we're good to go. We're actually good to go. Uh, we need a way of getting into here as well, though, which is a problem. Uh, I honestly think 
the, the best way of doing it would be to... I don't know, actually. Pivot? We can actually just whack a pivot directly in here like this. On one side, I guess. Probably only need to do it on one side. So delete these two. Put it right there. Uh, grab the canopy. All of this and all of this. I think. Maybe even just the top bit as well. Go ahead and... Or maybe all of it. Do we need all of it? Cut it. Alright, cool. Merge. Oh, wait. <laughs> I need to paste it back in. Merge this with this. And... Put that on a button that will go here. Actually, it'll go here. Button! Let's do this. So the button's gonna go right there like this. Um, which is fine. We need a switch box. Here we go, one of these. We're gonna put that right there. Switch box is gonna be on value is one. We're gonna connect this to here. We're gonna connect this to here. And we are good to go. Why is it already motoring along? Why is it driving off? What the? What the heck? All right, okay, hang on. This can't just be going going straight away. There's there's literally nothing to it. So why would it just drive off? Up and down. All right, we got this. Yeah. All right, sick. Okay, good. We need this landing gear to be on a uh, a thing as well. And also, uh, just as a side note, we need a little bit of weight in the front. So actually, it'll be a battery. Here we go. We haven't put any batteries in at the moment, so a battery going in here, not a problem, I don't think. In fact, we'll use these ones. So we can put a battery right there, a battery right there, uh, delete that, put a battery in the roof. Cool, put a battery there, put a battery there as well, a battery right here. All right, is that good? I think that might be good. I don't know. Uh, right, delete this. We need another switch box. Yes, just like this one. Put it on this side instead. Bam. And this is going to go directly to uh, here and also here. Okay, I think that's good. And this is going to go to two. But I think we are automatically need this to go on, if that makes sense. So off value is on, on value is off, if that makes sense. So when I press two, the landing gear should come in. What is it doing? What are you doing? Off value, oh, off value is one, not minus one. There we go. All right, sick. Okay, open up the door. That's brilliant. I'm going to make it, like, daytime so you guys can see what's going on here. It is currently driving around in circles, which sucks. That's super annoying. So let's put some brakes on. That will automatically go on, I guess. So... I'm going to actually put the brakes on a button. I think that's fine. So delete this. Uh, get ourselves a button. And we'll just put the brakes right there. So this will connect to here. It will also connect to here. And it will also connect to here. Uh, and it will automatically be on. Bam! There we go. Excellent, guys! Oh, this is sick. All right, inside we go. Go ahead and close the canopy. Okay, press... Nothing. Okay, I can't steer it. That is a problem. That is a definite, like, a big, big problem. But if we take off, it's fine. Don't worry. Okay, come on. Open sesame. Get inside. All right. Uh, close that. Excellent. We don't have enough power. <laughs> we don't have enough power at all to actually take off with this thing. And that's because there is no gearbox. Alright, put a gearbox in here. There we go. We're going to do this straight into here. Excellent. And we're going to do three to one. Okay, right. Come on. This has to work. Alright, everybody ready? Everybody ready? Go ahead and close this up. Oh, we can see outside. That's pretty weird. Go, go, go. There we go. We're in the sky. And we are flying the beast. Go ahead and press 2. Landing gear has folded up. The other landing gear isn't connected to it. Hang on. The other landing gear isn't connected to it. Also, I have like very limited control over this. But other landing gear. So connect. Where is it? 
This landing gear is connected to here, so this needs to go to there. It also needs to go to here. And that should actually lift up all the landing gear at once. Oh, I hate this. I hate when this happens, because it's opposite, right? So cut this, flip it, paste it, merge it back in. So merge this with this, this with this. And then do pretty much exactly the same thing on the other side. I think this will work. So cut this, paste it, merge this with this, merge this with this. Wait, did I change that or not? I don't think I changed it. Cut it, press U, paste it, now do it. Alright, this, 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 and this, and now go. No, it folds up the other way. Sag! Oh, this is super annoying. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? No! It's because this one is like, this one starts spawned inside, and then this one starts spawned outside. So we need them to both be the same, and I can't remember how to do it. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, oh, should I put it on a different, can I, this can control multiple things. So actually, if we just put a new switch box in, we should just put these on a new switch box and it'd be fine. All right, guys, I fixed it. Uh, and then for our actual controls, we're going to go to Finn Rudder or the Rudder. And we're going to go ahead and just do, uh, well, actually, we're going to do this real quick. We're going to go ahead and get one of these, put it right about there. Uh, get another one of these and put it right about here. Excellent. Go ahead and attach this to pitch. And to pitch. Good, and now we should be good to go, I think, maybe. All right, so if everybody's ready, let's go ahead and throttle up. Turn this off. Pitch it into the sky. I have extremely limited control over it. Oh, wait, the landing gear has done the, the wrong thing. The landing gear has definitely done the wrong thing. Oh, it's gone. There we go. But the other ones have actually gone the wrong way, which is annoying. Um, okay, right. We got control problems. We definitely have control problems. Uh, I need this, hang on, uh, on value to be minus one. There we go, so now it will work properly. Uh, except the pitch. The pitch won't work properly. So delete these guys. Actually, on both sides. So delete that and that. Delete this guy as well. And now spawn it in. See if it works. We're taking off. We're in the sky, and the pitch actually did work that time. Uh, however... We're having issues. Okay, so the pitch... Is inverted! That's why we're doing it! Okay, pitch is inverted, and now if we fix the pitch, everything else should be good. And we've built ourselves an entire vehicle uh, that was very easy to build, and everything works out well. Alright, bam bam. Go ahead and spawn it in again. It looks ugly, to be fair, but it's supposed to, so that's good. Jump inside. Close the canopy. Get this thing moving. Turn the brakes off. Take off into the sky. Did I even reattach it? I don't think I don't know if I reattached the. Uh, I, I shouldn't have to though, should I? I shouldn't have to reattach them. No, they're attached. They are attached. This is attached to pitch, which is W and S. Okay, so it should all be good. It's just a little bit difficult to fly. All right, everybody ready? Everybody ready? Go ahead and go. All right, let's take off. Alright, it's just back heavy. It's just like very back heavy. So we need to... I've got an idea for that. Uh, oh, I do have an idea for that, but it involves deleting this. Moving it all the way to the middle. Realistically, we would have a proper engine, but, you know, we don't at this point. We need a pipe. A pipe to go up and over. So upwards, backwards, upwards, backwards. There we go. It'll go up and over. We're going to make this one do the same. So up and back. And then this needs to go like this. From here. Directly onto here. Okay, so now we should have a better, a better function. Or a better functioning situation. Because our weight isn't all at the back. It's uh, further forwards now. Alright, let's go. Ready? Everybody ready? Go. It automatically, like, does its own thing. I don't really know what's going on here, but... We need it to work. I don't want to end the video without it working properly. 
Alright guys, I know what the problem is, so essentially it's just a little bit too strong for itself, so it is pushing us forwards, like, dramatically, but uh, it is pushing us forwards too much, and therefore uh, it, it's just a bit too much for the aircraft uh, to actually handle. But now, if uh, I've changed the gears, so it should be a little bit slower now. Here we go. Press 1 to turn on the uh, thingamabobby, good. Press 2 for the landing gear to fold away. The front one should sort of disappear as well. Excellent. And we have built ourselves the Northrop Black Bullet. Except it's green. But it works. Guys, it, it is actually working. That's cool. Oh, I say it's working. Uh, it doesn't actually want to nose down at all. But you know what? That's okay. I think we've done a pretty good job with this. Um, realistically, it does, or it would have guns on it. But since we are in the testing phase, it still wouldn't have had guns on in the testing phase. Also, my landing gear has fully worked. Look, it's actually fit into the area. That's really good. That's really good. Alright, so there is one more thing that I want to do to make it work at least a little tiny, tiny touch better. We're actually going to go ahead and put one of these in the front end uh, like so. We're going to put it in like that, and in fact, we'll have two of them. Uh, and essentially, they're going to help us to uh, do this, this pitch thing, hopefully. So put those both in. There we go. Excellent. Uh, they're both in the nose. Now, we should be good. Alright, let's go. Okay, excellent. Go ahead and lift this up. Press 2 for the landing gear to go away. It will sort of go away. There we go, excellent. And now we can actually fly it the way that you'd want to fly it. And that's sick. That is excellent. Guys, we did it. We've done it all in one video. Amazing. To be fair, uh, realistically, this thing would have an actual engine in it, so that's probably something that we'll do next time. But uh, I don't know if you guys want to see more of this. If you do, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll try and do a little bit more. If you guys don't want to see any more of this, again, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, but anyway, for now, thank you guys very much for watching. Let's see if the landing gear comes back out. It seems to be having a few issues. It seems to be having quite a few issues, actually. Please pop yourself back out. The wing ones are having a lot of problems. Like a, like many problems, actually. But yeah, anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!